Well, now we want to go to Port Aransas to take a look at an institution there that is celebrating 25 years of helping local artists. Island Moon newspaper publisher Dale Rankin has this week's Island Report. In the 1990s, a group of Port Aransas artists decided they needed a place to display and sell their work. 25 years later, the Port Aransas Art Center is still going strong. From seascapes to local history, since 1996, the Port Aransas Art Center has provided artists with a Port Aransas connection a showcase. Is there a style of art that you would describe as Port Aransas? Is there a Port Aransas school of art? No, I don't think so. Maybe you need to make one. <laughs> Maybe so. <laughs> we have a lot of artists that paint water, so right. I guess that's it, and birds. The new facility opened only two weeks before Hurricane Harvey and miraculously had only $150 worth of damage. It stayed open through the COVID virus, and now things are almost back to normal. So what's next? Uh, what's next? Well, uh, we're having an exhibit this coming month that is our all-member show, which should be a really good uh, exhibit. And we're trying to get back to having our first Fridays with, that we've had for 25 years. So mark your calendar for the first Friday of each month beginning this summer. The Island Arts Center will be ready to party arty. For 3 News and the Island Moon Newspaper, I'm Dale Rankin, and we'll see you on the island.